When you're trying to find the right house for somebody is to make sure that you sell them that house that is their home, not just a house. Hi, it's Adam Parsons with Buzzy Real Estate, Adam Parsons Group. The numbers are in for 2017 and like like to go through them with you really quickly. So sales for 2017 were 90, just a little over 92,000. And that is down a little bit over 18.3% 18, 18 from 2016. Uh, so the numbers in 2016 and 2015 were 113 and 115,000 sales throughout the GTA. Those were both record years. So previous to that, the sales were more in line with um, for 2017 in the 80 to 90,000 um, volume volume range for um, for the year. Uh, the average selling price for the GTA in 2017 was just a little over 822,000, and that's up about 12.7 percent from 2016. Uh, December sales for the GTA were 4,930, 4, so that's down about 7.1% uh, from the previous December of 2016. The average price was up slightly in December, 0.7%, so just under 1%. Let's look at the micro market right now. So C4, which is pretty much encompasses our, our North Toronto neighborhood, um, there was 40 sales in December and average price was just a little over 1.7 million, so a million seven fourteen. Those properties took 20 days to sell and sold on average for 98% of the asking price. December inventory was quite low. So the number of homes on the market was 1.7 uh, for the month. Uh, average market is generally is about four to six months inventory. So if no new homes came on the market, uh, we would be sold out in just a little under two months. So it still is really, the supply is really quite low, which has been indicative of the, of the whole year. Uh, the micro market for C4 for the whole year, for 2017, we had 829 sales. Um, the price, the average price was 1804, so 1,804,000. Those properties sold on average for six, on, in 16 days, and the average uh, price to sales ratio was 104%. So throughout the year, we had 4% over the asking price on average in 16 days. This is Adam Parsons with Bozzy Real Estate, Adam Parsons Group. That's your market update for January 2018.